we pulled our money back out because we put fifty thousand down. My point is that when when you do that that way, the payment is still real low and the property tax has never changed. And now I can do all the construction without nobody even knowing what it's really worth until we make it go through another escrow. It's either refinancing or selling. Refinancing and pulling more equity back out because now they're gonna do a new appraisal. So now there's gonna be a lot more equity involved. But when you do a construction loan, they automatically reevaluate re it after it's done. Now we can do that with a mobile home. The point is that all the mobile home is it serves many purposes. One, we get rid of the rent where we're at because we can't live in a bare land. So whatever, when we move to the property with the mobile home, we're no longer paying rent. Now we're paying on our own place, period. Whatever that condition is, it's gonna be used. It's not gonna be a new price. It's gonna be really antique, whatever, you know, we can put, we got appliances, we can put appliances. That, that's all cash, see, that's the point. So getting the mobile home there, Modesto thing, hopefully it's still in business in four years. It's a plan, okay? Here's, here's the best part about the mobile home, is that we can leave it alone, and I can live in it when we add to it. So in other words, we can make it to where it has like two double doors. We'll make a, a double door from like, somewhere in the living room, right? So the, so the mobile home will go from, from that to a nice family room slash master suite with the bathroom. And that'll turn into the hall bath eventually down the road. So it goes, it goes big family room, which would be my, my bedroom with the bathroom. 